In the final countdown to the total solar eclipse, North Texans are making plans for the day and preparing to capture this once in a lifetime moment. Our Allie Spilliards joined a local photography club, making sure they have the right tools and technique. If next month's solar eclipse was a final exam, you don't get to practice, you don't get, you don't get a second chance. This is it. This would be the cram session. And you can get distracted because it's like, wow, wow, wow. Today, photographer David Down shared his expertise with the Herd Nature Photography Club on how to best capture the moment that the sun, earth, and moon align next month. If you live in this area, it's like that once in a lifetime opportunity. So we're trying to take advantage of it. Just like glasses are essential for those hoping to watch, Downs explained photographer's tools. You should get a, a solar filter if you have a camera. Mylar being most affordable. Glass filters are another option. We don't have to travel anywhere to go see it. It's right here in our own, literally in our own backyards. Member Stephen Earls was among those here polishing skills first practice last fall during the annular eclipse. I figured out I can do it. With thousands expected to flock to North Texas communities on April 8th, Downs reminded those planning to take part to arrive early and to prepare for crowds. He also encouraged them to take a break from the viewfinder, to soak in a moment most will never experience again. They say, you know, a picture is worth a thousand words. Um, I, I think a, a photograph doesn't do this justice. In McKinney, Alley Spilliards, NBC5. NBC5 will have reports throughout the month, and on April 8th, we will be broadcasting the eclipse live from the lawn at Reunion Tower and at more than a dozen sites all across North Texas and beyond. You can find updates at NBCDFW.com eclipse.